Hi, I'm Courtney Harder with Case IH. In this video, we are going to go through the frame calibration process on a 2150 early riser planter. The reason that we want to calibrate our frame each season is to assign the toolbar heights at which the planter is going to start and stop planting and where we raise to our limited raise heights on the headlands. So we first select calibration. Now our calibration type is going to be frame. Now from here we start our frame calibration. So our, uh, our calibration full frame process um, numbers exactly what we need to do, exactly um, the process of, of this calibration for you. And the frame position legend here is going to explain to you um, with, the, with the black bar, it's going to explain to you where the toolbar currently is. And then each little colored bar on this, on this graph here is going to explain where our start stop plant heights are as well as our unfold and our limited raise height. So you can compare your current toolbar position to where, uh, where each of your set calibrations are. So to go through the calibration process, we first click next. Now we are going to calibrate the stop plant height. So we can see that our frame height is currently raised all the way up to our unfold height. So we're gonna lower that toolbar to the point that we want our row units to stop planting. Um, typically we want to set this, we wanna go all the way down with the toolbar and then feather that toolbar up to the point that it's not making full ground contact, but it still is making um, a little bit of ground contact. So it's not fully engaged in the ground. Um, once we uh, like where our stop plant height is set at, we are going to click next, and then we're going to calibrate our start plant height. So we raise our toolbar up to the point where we want it to start planting. Um, typically, this is when we can see a little bit of, uh, of, of daylight underneath of those row units, right before it's about to go into the ground. Um, once we like where our toolbar is for our start plant height, we're going to click next, and we're gonna repeat the process for our limited raise and our unfold height. Um, one comment, uh, make sure that you've got adequate space between the start stop and the start plant height. We always want that start plant height to be higher than our stop plant height. So with that, um, we are going to go through the full calibration process for you. Once you've completed the calibration, you will get a screen that says calibration successful, and it will also tell you when the last save calibration was just for confirmation. For more information on calibrating the, the frame height on your 2150 toolbar, refer to your operator's manual or contact your local Case IH dealer.